everyone. My name is Gary van Vieren, and I will be your lecturer for this masterclass course, Basel III, What You Need to Be Compliant. Um, just by quick way of introduction, uh, I have a background in physics, and I've worked for retail invest and investment banks, asset managers, uh, rating agencies, and consultancies, both uh, in the UK and in South Africa for about 25 years. And I've also given many, many courses for a master, master class. Uh, now, many of you will be aware of the regulatory rules, the Basel regulatory rules, the global uh, bank regulator, and the various accords, Basel 1, Basel 2, Basel 3, Basel 4. Basel 1 is pretty much dead. Basel 2 kicked in in 2008. And then, of course, there was the disastrous two, uh, credit crisis of that year. So Basel, the, the, the regulatory body decided, listen, we need to fix this. So along came Basel III, which did not replace Basel II, but it patched up holes and, and errors that were very much uh, you know, present in, in the Basel II Accord. And if banks want to be Basel compliant, they need to be Basel III compliant now. It, that's pretty much the new accord that, that is in place. If you want to call yourself Basel III compliant, you need to know what those rules are. And it was a phased in approach and that phase has ended now and uh, 2019 already. So all banks that wish to be Basel compliant should be Basel III compliant by now. And this course will cover all of that with many Excel examples as possible and practical examples along the way. Um, this will benefit uh, people, uh, auditors, people in uh, risk management and people in um, compliance, in, mainly in banks.